guys, Atkin Reviews here today with an, a review of the Apple Remote. So anyway, uh, this application, what it does is it controls your iTunes and or if you've got an Apple TV it controls that. Just focus. Well, anyway, um, the logo is. It's just like a. There you go. You can probably see it from there. It's just kind of like a play button. Right, and what you have to do is, if I can, I'm just going to rethink it all up. So, what you do is you click on remote. It says connect into Atkins library because I've already connected up so um, I'm just going to show you how to connect it. Right, settings. So this is what will come up without the Atkins library bit. And all you have to do is click add library. And then through Wi-Fi off your computer and everything, it connects. And as you can see there, my device is called Atkin. So it's come up with the app logo. What you have to do, click on that, and it says to enter a passcode. Right there. And on the device, it gives you a passcode. Like mine is 4481. As soon as you've entered it, it just comes up with what song you're playing. And you can do the volume and everything. I'll just demonstrate now. Oh, one sec, guys. Alright, as you can see up there, look. So here's the iPod volume. Oh. And watch. As I pull it down on iTunes, it goes down as well. Oh, can't get it now. So like so. And this is just set out like your regular music player. As you can see, look, click there for albums and everything. And what you do is you set what volume you want. So let's say I only want it mid. And then you play. As you can tell, it is coming out of the laptop. So if I just show you the range, I'm gonna go into the kitchen and I'm going to turn it up full. So I'm just walking over to the kitchen. Sorry about the washing machine gone. And I'm going to play it from here. And it is in the background. I'm not sure if you can hear it though. So. As you can tell. It's quite a nice app actually. Especially if you're the other side of the room. And you don't want to get up just to change your song. It's free from the App Store. And it's got all your artists. Right there. And you can search stuff in your on your thing. And then it comes up with all your albums. And then you can click more. And you can view. So let's just say TV show here. I've got a Family Guy episode so... I go like here and I click on that. Sorry. You have no idea, do you? Of course I do. It just shows up there. Well then why did and you, you can skip it and god knows what else. So guys, all in all, this is a great app. It's free. It is made by Apple and it's so easy to use as well. I mean if you use the thingy then you're used to this. So Guys, great app if your laptop's far away in the room, then you always you don't need a Mac either, it can be Windows, it's just that you need iTunes, so just play an out outro song, Ashley by Escape the Fate. So thanks guys, and I'll see you in the next